Hi, I'm Onita Manning, and before my cabinets were a bleached maple, and now they are a dark cherry with the help of Kitchen Doctors. The team from Kitchen Doctors were very professional, and they were able to help me transform my kitchen. They did custom builds on my shelving, and they were also able to face the inside of my cabinets where I have glass. The team from Kitchen Doctors have a quality of finishes, accessories, and I love Kitchen Doctors. They only took three days, and within three days I had a new cabinets, new refacing, and new um, handles also. And they were very clean. Every day they cleaned up after they left. And also, something that they did was I love was they also refaced the inside of my cabinet. They were very professional and very friendly, and I highly recommend the Kitchen Doctors. Hi, we're the Perrys, Sue and Wayne. Welcome to our new kitchen. If you can imagine our kitchen before this, it was white and the cabinets were all part of a board that were falling apart. And Jim from Kitchen Doctors came in and put in a brand new cherry kitchen for us. But it's all refaced. Uh, the doors are new, the, the Drawer fronts are new, the, uh, and then of course the refacing on all of the cabinets uh, turned out beautiful. They did an excellent job. And the reason why we went with refacing was because we had so much money invested in the granite. The people that owned our house before us put all this beautiful granite in, and we asked to have different companies to come in and just replace the cabinets, and no one would guarantee that they wouldn't ruin our granite. So refacing made the most sense for us. It was the least um, least expensive way to go, and if you look, it looks like a brand new kitchen. And they basically took three days. The first day they came in and took off all of the doors, all, all of the drawers, <clears throat> and started refacing the white cabinets. Uh, the second day they came back in with the new doors and drawers, uh, and hardware, which was new also, uh, and put, put it all together. And the third day, Jim came uh, to do the finish work. And it, amazingly, it was done within three days, and there, there was no mess. Every day that they left, everything was cleaned right up. It was, uh, he did a great job. Jim's attention to detail is just unbelievable. If you look at our china, or well, I call it china cabinet, but <laughs> our glass front cabinets, he, he helped design those. He helped pick out the corbels and this little piece that goes above our cooktop. And then, of course, all of the crown molding, it just pulls everything together. So if you're looking for the best, go to Jim, go to Kitchen Doctors. Hi, I'm Gary Werwell. My wife and I are residents of Geechland County. I wanted to spend a few minutes and tell you about a kitchen remodel we just finished. Uh, I'm just going to start over here. Uh, this area was a desk here, actually, and we had a, uh, uh, just a reach-in pantry here. This was all demolished, and we had uh, new cabinets brought in. Uh, th these cabinets to mar match the refacing we had done on, on our other cabinets, and I'll show those to you. But we had the sink and the countertops put in here as well. Uh, over here, this part of the kitchen was actually uh, all pine uh, cabinets and they were done in a green, a light green color. Uh, so we had them completely refaced and uh, the new doors on them, the maple doors. Uh, all the handles were put on, um, all the hardware here. I'll tell you what impressed us so much uh, during this project, which only took us three days, 
Um, was that after each day Jim and kitchen doctors were here, they cleaned up their, completely cleaned up their mess and we've been having some other things go on here and there's quite a dichotomy between other contractors and what Jim and kitchen doctors did. Uh, I'd like to finish by just saying how pleased we are with the outcome here. It's been a, uh, just a wonderful experience working with kitchen doctors. I would certainly recommend them Please give them a call, they do a great job. Hi, we're the Tamandals. I'm Cheryl, my husband, Tony, and you're here in our beautiful new kitchen. Uh, we moved here to this house about five and a half years ago, and when we moved in, the cabinets were dark, knotty pine. We never really cared for the kitchen as it was, but you know, we lived, a, we've lived with it for about five years and finally just decided we needed to do something. Well, we met uh, Jim and Monica at a business networking event and uh, we learned about the kitchen doctors. So we thought, well, let's look into it. And we had Jim come out. Uh, of course, he was very, very prompt. He brought many, many samples for us to look at. And we weren't quite sure what we wanted to do, but we know, knew we wanted to lighten the cabinets and do something other than the knotty pine, which for us was a little bit too country for our tastes. But we had some constraints with the darker wood uh, molding, and, and so Jim was excellent at helping us to figure out just the right type of uh, wood, the coloring, the finish. Um, it, it just turned out beautifully. Um, he had to work with some constraints in the kitchen, and he did some detail work that was, was fantastic. As you can see on this cabinet, um, the finish doesn't, isn't just on the outside, but it extends to the inside where they finish the shelves and the, the molding around the cabinets. Uh, I just can't say enough good about how, uh, what a great job they did. Um, One of the things that uh, really impressed both of us is that uh, he, he measured once uh, and he met the time schedule, came, uh, came on time uh, as promised and, uh, and got the whole job done in two days, which it was just amazing. It was really a, a very good experience. And they cleaned up after themselves uh, totally. There was nothing left for us to do except put the dishes back in the cabinet. So if you're thinking about uh, any kind of kitchen work or bathroom work, uh, call Jim and Monica at the Kitchen Doctors. You'll be glad you did. Joan and Bob Goble and we're here to tell you about the Kitchen Doctor. We've been in the house for about 23 years when we decided to refresh the kitchen and we looked at a variety of options. Uh, we looked at replacing the, the formica that was here, we looked at marble, we looked at all those different surfaces, we looked at taking out the cabinets and we met Jim at one of the shows in Richmond and we got his card and had him come out and he brought in all his stuff and we took a real good look at it and we decided to go with this uh, formica and instead of tearing out the cabinets we replaced the cabinets by replacing the doors resurfacing and they do a nice job with the fits and finishes by going ahead and they, they do the front of the, the shelves that are already in the cabinets so they blend in they've got uh, paint that goes and matches so when you look at it you'd never know that it's not a whole new cabinet. Uh, they replaced, there was a old wooden valence up here and there was a single fluorescent tube. We took that down and opened this whole area up and throws off a lot more light. And we also have, this is what the old cabinets look like so that's why we knew it was time for them to go. And we've been very pleased with them. They, they bring everything themselves, it's a turnkey operation. And new hardware, they bring us several selections for the new hardware, so you get to pick out your new hardware. Uh, we had several drawers that they replaced because the old drawers were just very un unsteady. So they put in new drawers that uh, close naturally by themselves and are very nice, and I wish I had done on more of the drawers. 
And then uh, we've liked them so much, we called them back and they did our three bathrooms for us. And um, they did my mother's kitchen, my mother's two bathrooms, our neighbor's kitchen across the street. Another neighbor, uh, another friend of my husband uh, had, her, had them over to do their kitchen. So we have been very pleased. Uh, we also have them do the, they replaced the sink. Uh, they, we've got a new stove and they, they put the stove in for us. So it was two and a half days and uh, all the details and the finishes. Jim is probably much more cautious than we are about the details. So we gave Jim a call. We think you should. He did a great job and we're thrilled. Hi, um, we're the Wards. I'm Jill. I'm Mike. And we just want to tell you what a great job kitchen doctors did for our kitchens. I love them. Um, it took us about two years to get to the point where we were ready to hire somebody. We went very slowly and paid as we go. So when it was time to do the cabinets, which were um, painted white and had big jagged zigzags down there, not because they had zigzags, but because they were broken and we had stapled them together, um, we got a number of estimates trying to find the person we thought could do the best job at the best price. Um, so we got a couple estimates and I wasn't real excited about them. A, they were very high. And B, I asked them if there were several things they could do and everybody said no, they couldn't do it. I'll tell you what those are in just a minute. Um, but when Jim uh, walked in the kitchen, he's looking around, measuring things, getting an eyeful. We wanted to keep all our cabinets the way they are now, um, with the exception that the refrigerator was moved. So Jim comes in here with his measuring tape. First thing he does is he sees the island that we have right here. He gets out his measuring tape, he goes, you know, this isn't really enough room to walk in. I said, uh, if I were you, I would consider moving this. And we were like, what? That wasn't anywhere near our plan. He said, as a matter of fact, I could move this island over here to cover up the space where your refrigerator was. And he did it. And I love it. We have all this room now. No one else, of course, thought of that. But he suggested that. And it wasn't even on our radar. And he did a great job of it, too. Um, and so then, I, one of the main things I really wanted was one of these Lazy Susans. I wanted something that we could put stuff in, and this voice was so small that the other people who came and did estimates for us all measured and looked like they were thinking about it and said, no way we can put a Lazy Susan in there, it just can't be done. So Jim came in and measured for about five minutes, over and over and over. He goes, yeah, sure, I can do that. It's like, you're kidding, that's fantastic. He said, and if you want, I will put in a spice rack for you too. I'm like, no, that's wonderful. Uh, utterly unbelievable, I was so excited. So we got everything we wanted, Jim put it in, and guess what? His price was lower than anybody else that we went, not by a tremendous amount, but enough to let us know, A, this guy was extremely professional, but he was also reasonable. And when he came in with this crew, he did such a phenomenal job. He helped us pick out the cabinets. Um, we used alder instead of cherry. I know these look like cherry, um, but alder is actually a lighter wood and it gets lighter with age or cherry gets darker with age. So I wanted something that didn't get too dark. And then he helped us pick out the knobs and um, everything was so easy. His wife, Monica, was fantastic too. She sat there with us through a number of choices. Yeah, it's funny, when you're redoing a kitchen, there's so much going on, you wanna make sure everything matches and looks good. They made it painless. So we actually had a good time doing it. We're not prone to stress about stuff anyway. Um, but it was wonderful. And he came in with his crew and took, what? A day and a half. Day and a half. Refaced all our cabinets, and he's done. We couldn't be any happier. One of the great things about this kitchen was the cabinet space was really pretty much what we wanted. Um, and when Jim and the, the kitchen doctors came in, uh, they took a look and took measurements, tried to determine what the best uh, layout would be. And it, it was to keep these heavy duty stock cabinets the way they are. Um, heavy duty three quarter inch pine, uh, very sturdy cabinets, so why take those down? And what they did was come in and put in new cabinet doors and facings and the veneer and everywhere where the angles touch is just immaculate. Uh, people come in here and can't believe that the cabinets themselves aren't new because they look brand new. Yeah. Um, it's all veneer. The crown molding was cut to match the alder wood from uh, the white that blends into the, to the rest. In addition to the spice rack, 
that uh, Jim put in here, which is a rollout. We also have uh, a rollout for pots and pans that um, are just really easier to get to all the way around. Uh, the quality of the uh, workmanship was uh, really good. Um, they were very efficient, very flexible, as Jill described before. Moving this island was just <laughs> one of those brainstorming type of things that, why didn't we think of that? Yeah. And um, everything fit. Um, everything was, was done in a way that uh, really kept the flow of the kitchen the way we wanted it, opened it up, gave us more space, and then gave us these great cabinet doors that uh, really hold up to the wear and tear. Um, I've been really amazed with this laminate wood and the doors themselves um, don't have any scratches from some pretty heavy use since this has been done. So the fingernails and the, and the uh, cuttings and, and things like that that you might see in the pine wood that was here before, you don't have to worry about that here. Um, and Mike does, um, Mike does carpentry or, or did um, some carpentry and woodworking so he is very picky. I was watching everything they were doing and, and very interested in what they were doing too and how they could actually create uh, the, the facings to, to fit so nicely with the cabinets that you can't tell that they're really completely separate. Yep. Uh, the other thing that uh, Jim uh, offered to do after we uh, questioned it and, and had some uh, hopeful desires that we could actually do this was to do the bathroom vanity with the same wood that would match here. So it was a great way to kind of tie in the bathroom and the colors of this kitchen into the bathroom itself. And in the big picture, we couldn't be happier with um, what they did. I mean, they did a great bang up job. And uh, honestly, anybody who wants any more information about this type of work and what Kitchen Doctors did for us, be happy to talk to them, give us a call. Be great. We were not paid for this, by the way. This right. is just volunteer because we're so excited about their work.